Pride Desiree, week, no not week, I keep getting that confused, milestone one, task two, your travel guide. All right, so, uh, yeah, weather can be a, uh, uh, throw a monkey wrench into plans, but I think considering what you have here, the weather actually worked out well for you. Um, uh, housekeeping items, uh, everything looks pretty, really good. Um, the only thing missing is a couple pieces of metadata. Just, uh, make sure to review that on the, uh, homepage announcement, uh, in the five different pieces I'm looking for. Um, so, you know, going through your images, I, I always look at the, the contact sheets before I look at the two final critique images and kind of get a feel for which two I hope to see, um, that you've chosen to talk about, and uh, one out of my two you chose. So let's kind of jump into that really quick. So of the two, um, you know, this one is nice. I, I love the uh, the drawings here on the uh, the boarded up doors and windows. Uh, I think it's very interesting. It's a very very talented person who was able to draw those. The one that really drew me in was this one right here, was the bench. Um, uh, I mentioned this in a different uh, video that I'm really drawn to benches, but this one, the, the weatheredness of the wood, I don't know if that's actual natural or if there was somebody just distressed that, but, uh, you know, the, the uh, little flags and the material here, uh, you know, very softness of the wood and the very hardness of the, the brick, I think play well off of each other. So there was that one that I really like. Uh, other ones that I found... Uh, I was really drawn to, I'm going to zoom in on your contact sheets just a little bit here. All right, was, um, you know, I, I like this one here. I like the strong use of line kind of going through. Uh, this clash is all about photographic design, so the line is, is big. Be a little bit careful of the rule of thirds with the seagull here. If we kind of draw an X through the image, boom, it's kind of right there in the very center. It's what I tend to refer to as the bullseye effect. Um, so let's just make sure that we get him either on one of the one-third lines, hot here, here, or we're at intersection up there, 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 or there. Um, but the other ones that I really liked, um, I was I'm attracted to this one with the bicycles, with it kind of pulling me down and through. Um, this one with the the, the brick or cobblestone uh, uh, road, with the and then you can tell it's uh, been rained on, it's all wet. Um, you know, this one here, uh, even this here, again, the use of uh, repetitive lines. So you've got a whole bunch of really strong images you could choose from. Um, like I said, for me, this one is nice, but I think for me personally, there's, there's stronger ones. Um, so, yeah, um, all in all, good job. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate and shoot me an email.